Hello, 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 everybody. Thank you all for tuning in. I know this is a big night with the debate, so we hope we can get this moving and grooving before the debate starts. You know, we've been off for about maybe four or five weeks, something like that. A lot of good things been happening. I'll explain some of that as you go along. Hope you all are holding up, doing well, feeling blessed and engaged, y'all, because that's very, very important. Um, wow. So many big changes happen. I'll, I'll explain some of that stuff to you as we go along. But since we're starting a little late, had a little bit of technical difficulties, we're going to just uh, get ready to get settled in, give the rules and regulations of the show. You know how we do. For those of you that are new to the show, we normally do a, um, a countdown. Go from one on up to like 50. Start with low items. You get to higher items. Um, we got, uh, normally we will start with a number like this. You'll see a number like this, number one, and that's the item number. You will put this item number in the comments section. Uh, that, you don't have to know the titles. Just know the number. Just say number and sold. And then that way we know you want to make a commitment to that piece. Why do you have to put the number and sold? Because that's just so we can know you committed. Because sometimes people will say, they might have number one and they might just put one. They might have a side conversation going on. This is the way we try to keep our order straight. So you'll put the item number and the word sold and we will send it to you. All right, y'all. So, you know, we start very, very low. We go high. We have a lot of good stuff on the show today. We try to come up with a different menu every week. I will tell you through October, I will probably be doing a bi-weekly schedule. I possibly might end up getting three in this month. Uh, as you uh, know, when I took my break, I can tell you now before I get started, we were working on a very, very special project. So I'll be resuming that project. Uh, big announcement, y'all. Guess what? Larry Poncho Brown has gone vegan. <laughs> Your boy decided to jump off the plant-based cliff. And I'm feeling pretty good about it. This is my fourth week. So some of the things that I used to do on the show, I probably won't be doing, y'all. So y'all keep praying for me. I'm doing well so far. Just uh, <laughs> having a whole lot of chicken dreams. I'm going to start with item number one, y'all. Item number one. Item number one, uh, we normally do some little small little things. I'm going to show you item number one. It is a button, a lapel button. It's called the Buy Black Art lapel button. This little teeny wonder here can go on your jacket just to let folks know you know what's going on and what's happening. Uh, it's going to take me a while to get back acclimated to using this camera again, so bear with me. As you can see, this is the Black Art Buy Black Art button. It normally sells for $2. We're so starting off item number one. If you would like to get this little button for your lapel, just put item number one and sold, and you will have the Buy Black Art button for just a lowly $2, y'all. Look at them ashy hands, y'all. Y'all know I've been working today, right? Item number one, we have just officially begun. All right, y'all. Here we go. Item number two, y'all. Item number two. Item number two is what we call the Art Lover Pin. The Art Lover Pin has a uh, Sankofa symbol in the background. It's just to let folks know what you're all about. You can put that on your jacket. You got this. This is fall, y'all. We're in fall. All that fall gear is coming out, and this stuff will look wonderful on your fall gear. This is item number two, the Art Lover Pin. It sells for just three dollars get one for you and one other one for a friend if you like you know we are embarking on the holiday season y'all so we will probably be doing shows just about every week in november prior to christmas 
and Black Friday and all that. We'll keep you posted on the days we decide to select. Item number three, y'all. Item number three is one we bring back every now and then. This is the Embrace. The Embrace sticker, y'all. You know, everybody nowadays got an iPad, they got a laptop, they got all these different things, and this is a good little item to put on the back of your tech because, you know, we are working from home and working from school and all these other things, and we're, we're using this kind of equipment. I think that's going to be our normal, new normal. This is the Embrace sticker, y'all. The Embrace sticker sells for just $3. $3, y'all. Y'all could be carrying art on the back of your tech. This is item number three. Item number three is the Embrace sticker, y'all. The Embrace sticker. That's right, y'all. Just put number three and sold, and that piece will be coming to you. Item number four, y'all. You know we got to keep on celebrating this Black Lives Matter. You see, I'm sporting this. I, you know what? I've been getting some wonderful shirts. People have been sending me all kinds of shirts, so I hope to engage them in the next couple of weeks. Item number four is... The Black Lives Matter hologram sticker, y'all. Look at that. I don't want you to get hypnotized, but this has got refractions of light. You put this on your gear, people are going to know what you're all about, y'all. This is the Black Lives Matter hologram sticker, y'all. This sells for just a lowly $4. If you would like this item, put number four and sold. And the BLM hologram sticker will be coming your get man you need to get about three or four of these to get to your peoples that's what i'm talking about item number four and so and the blm hologram sticker will be coming your way that's right y'all item number five item number five is a we have these little charms that we show every now and then on the show this isn't a little acrylic charm it measures probably about two and a half inches maybe it's made out of one uh, eighth inch acrylic. You can make a key tag out of that. You can make a little necklace out of it. You might find another interesting little project to put that incorporated into. This is the interdependence charm, y'all. It sells for $4. If you would like the interdependence charm, just put item number four and sold. And this piece, item number five, will be coming your way. Uh, people been liking the charms, y'all. I've seen them a couple of times. He, you know what? If you got some charms out there, uh, send me a couple of ideas of what you're using them for. We introduced those probably back earlier in the spring. And I'm sure y'all got them in your hands by now. Item number six, y'all. Item number six is uh, we're getting to a whole suite. Done with our buttons. We gave you a couple of stickers. Uh, we gave you a charm. Now we're going to show you a couple of magnets. These are streamlined magnets can go on anything you like that has a metallic surface. This is an old favorite to the show. This is the Surrender Magnet, y'all. The Surrender Magnet is one of our popular pieces from our Perseverance series. As you can see, streamlined. It doesn't even, it's not even, a, well, I can't even give you a measurement on that one. But it is a very, very strong magnet. It will stick to anything that's metallic. This is the Surrender Magnet, y'all. This sells for just $4. This is item number six. If you would like item number six, just put number six and so and the surrender magnet will be coming your way. On that same subject, yo, item number seven. Item number seven is, you know, I just sold this original to a collector. Uh, they bought this off my website. This piece is entitled The Door of No Return and we've made it into a magnet. The Door of No Return is a symbolic piece for me because I took a trip to Gory Island with a group of artists and art collectors and I visited that door that's called the Door of No Return. Um, Gory Place, it's an interesting <laughs> term, the Gory Island, because it's actually a place where slaves were actually delivered on ships from that location. And so I envisioned me, uh, as I returned to the Door of No Return, and that's uh, kind of symbolic of what this piece stands for. It was actually a wooden plate. It sold last week. This piece can be yours for just $4. If you want a little something that's going to cause a little conversation on your uh, fancy little uh, 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 appliances in your kitchen or wherever else you do your thing. This is item number seven. Just put number seven in sold. And the Do of No Return magnet 
will be coming your way. On the same subject, y'all, item number eight. Item number eight is also another magnet. This one is a plate that I did that was entitled Nobility. Nobility, the magnet. Look at that. Can you imagine that as a bamboo plate? That piece sold quite a few years ago, but here we go. If you would like to have this piece, this is entitled Nobility. It's a three inch round magnet. This is item number eight. If you would like item number eight, this is number eight in Seoul. You can get the Nobility magnet, y'all. The magnet. That's right. Uh, yeah, so your boy decided he was going to try to start a vegan lifestyle, a an, no animal plant based lifestyle. And trust me, the brother has had a challenge in four weeks. I've been having fried shrimp and chicken dreams. But I think I'm going to be OK. I'm out the woods. This is the first time I ever tried veganism. So that includes dairy. Because, you know, this brother right here, not only does he make a serious omelet, he can eat a serious omelet. Item number nine is something we show every now and then on the show. This is our autograph art card set. This is a postcard set. You can either use this to write notes on. Or you can use this to frame all of the pieces inside this pack. I'll try to get the reflections off of it. All the pieces on this. Let me take it out the package for you. It's five pieces in the set. They're all autographed. That's it. This is the autograph art card set. You can. Here's one. Some of our popular images. That's number two. These all frame up really nice into a five by seven frame. But they also could make a really nice little card to send somebody. Oh, there you go. You know, I got to learn how to use the camera again, y'all. I've been away for a minute. Here's another one. And this is a five card set. This is the autograph art card set. It sells for just five dollars. Just five cards. All five cards autographed. If you would like this set, just put item number nine and sold and that piece this card set will be coming your way item number nine item number 10 you know we always try to spread some love and make you guys try to pick up uh, an ink pen and some stamps and some envelopes or whatever else you need to start connecting with people because you know we've been locked in for a minute we're in a different world now this is our new normal so it's always nice to send somebody a nice little card let them know they're doing okay here you go this is the family no card pack. It comes with three cards and three envelopes. These sets sell for eight dollars, y'all. Eight dollars. You could you could make three people's day. It comes to three envelopes. I'm sure you don't need me to show you those, right? OK, these are the three cards. They're all family themed cards. That's one card. This one is called Spirit of Fatherhood. Second card. This one's titled Now and Forever. Third card, this one is titled The Possibilities. So you get to give somebody a little something that's warm that says, hey, I'm OK. I got you. I'm glad you're doing OK. This is the family no card pack with envelopes, y'all. Three envelopes. Just get yourself three self-adhesive stamps. Make three people's day at one time. Boom. Eight dollars, y'all. So that's item number eight and um, item number 10. It sells for eight dollars. That's a wonderful gift to give somebody around these kind of times when things are so quiet for everybody. You know, it's a lot of loneliness going on. Item number 10 and sold. And those cards will be coming to you. You know, they say uh, the depression levels are on an all time high right now. Y'all, I hope y'all are not suffering with any sorts of depression. I have had my share of struggles over the years. But I'm doing OK with mine. I'm keeping myself occupied. You know what I learned, y'all? Most of my art for artist friends and people who were very creative are in a really vi a high bri vibration right now. So those of you that are kind of sitting around and you, you, you just seem out of sync, get yourself a coloring book, get yourself a pad, do some writing, get yourself and start doing some journaling or try to draw, do some painting, get a coloring book. That's that that's going to tap into your creative side of your brain. I find that this day and age we need those kind of breaks and it definitely keeps me running smooth. Item number 11, y'all. Item number 11 is something we had on our early shows 
back when we was at Poncho Thon number one, and we are proudly at Poncho Thon number 26, y'all, in case you're not keeping track. This is Poncho Thon number 26. We will probably be at 30 before Christmas, y'all. Here you go. We're going to do some rare gifts that we create around here. This is known as a key holder, but you know, the first one is called Each One Teach One. As you can see, it has four key rings on the bottom. I'll tilt it so you can see the key rings. There it is. And it comes with uh, one of my popular pieces on it. But you know, I've seen some creative things with these. People are putting keys on them. One lady sent me a picture of hers. It's in her kitchen. She stores her spoons and spatulas on it. So it's all up to your creativity, y'all. But this is the key holder. The each one teach one key holder, they sell for $20, y'all. They come with my signature and they come sig um, autographed by me. This is the each one teach one key holder, item number 20. That's it, item number 20. And I mean, I'm, is this item number 20? That's it, number 20. I said that wrong. This sells for $20. This is item number 11. If you would like this key holder, put item number 11 and sold. And each one teach one key holder. I have somebody put online a mask holder. <laughs> I like that. It becomes a really nice mask holder. I like those ideas, y'all. I might change the title on it, y'all. There you go. Item number 11 and sold. And that key holder slash mask holder. Thank you, Linda, for your suggestion is will be coming your way. But wait, we're going to try to hit you twice. Item number 12, y'all. Item number 12 is another one we called the power. The power is another four ring key holder, mask holder, uh, spatula holder, whatever you want to do with it holder. These are a nice size. They carry a lot of weight. They're made out of plywood and mounted with my art and it comes with a hanging device on the back. This one is entitled the power, the key holder. This is item number 12. If you would like item number 12, it sells for just $20. Just put item number 12 and sold. And this key holder, slash mask holder, slash spatula holder will be coming your way. All right, y'all. We're going to move to a different section of the show. Get into some books. And we're getting ready to get to something that is really, ah, uh, you guys get to see the first of this new item, I got a new item that y'all been waiting for all year. It's get ready to be coming up real soon. So I'm going to show you a couple of things. That this 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 whole thing is a collectible show about books, um, exhibition catalogs. You know, Poncho just ventured into this new thing now, where he's actually doing um, 3D mapping of exhibition spaces and shows. So if you guys are interested in anything like that, make sure you hit me up in my email. Item number 13, y'all. Item number 13 is a catalog I show you every now and then. It's a small catalog of an exhibition I did at the Frederick Douglass Myers Museum. It has a few of my music pieces. The show was titled Music by Poncho. This is a smaller catalog. As you can see, it has a few, a little bit of writing about my philosophy of my musical pieces. You see it comes autographed, that big old signature in the front. Also has a couple of my jazz pieces. And then it also has one of my metal jazz pieces and a bio, y'all. And this comes autographed. It's a nice little thing to put in your coffee table, you know, put in your collection of stuff. If you're collecting, you're gonna need some collectible items to go with the works that you collect. This is the perfect one. The Music by Poncho exhibition catalog only sells for $10. It comes autographed. If you would like this catalog, just put item number 13. Item number 13 and sold. And the catalog Music by Poncho will be coming your way. Get one for you and one for your friend, too. That's right, y'all, because this gift giving season is upon us pretty soon. I ain't trying to go too fast. Now, I'm not putting the Christmas tree up, but you know what I'm talking about. Item number 14, y'all. Item number 14 is another one. You know, uh, this shirt, <laughs> you know, I'm trying to represent today, right? I'm not trying to represent. I am representing. There you go. So this book right here has all of my serious pieces. It's called the Collages Catalog. It has a signature on the front, too. I signed these. This book has a collection 
of all of my serious pieces. I do a whole series of thought provoking pieces that deal with slavery, apartheid, uh, perseverance, uh, civil rights, uh, human rights, uh, women's rights. And these are my more serious pieces. OK, um, I did a whole show of this at a, a place here in Baltimore called the Motor House. And I got a chance to show this whole collection and we actually unveiled this catalog at that show. It's been a very, very nice catalog uh, for me because it represents some of my serious works. These things say something to me, they speak to you. So um, this is probably the portfolio of my most serious works. You see, that's a piece I did of Trayvon Martin in, in the, on the other side there. And has a little bio about me in the back, and it has uh, one of my popular pieces that wraps around the catalog. This is the cap the um, Collages catalog. <coughs> Item number fourteen, y'all. Item number fourteen sells for twenty five dollars. If you would like the Collages catalog, just put item number fourteen and sold. And this catalog, this exhibition catalog, very rare, will go nice on your coffee table book or in your important items. I am number 14 and sold in this catalog will be coming your way. We do have a new catalog coming out in the next. Whew, yeah, probably the next two weeks or so. We got a brand new catalog coming out. So be looking forward to be out long before the holidays. Item number 15, y'all. Item number 15 is another exhibition catalog we did for a show I did at Baltimore City Hall before our mayor got in trouble with the law. She gave me the most dynamic solo show that I've had in Baltimore City in my lifetime here. She, uh, the Baltimore City Hall Galleries has two exhibition halls and my work filled both sides of the City Hall. So this book right here was actually dedicated to that exhibition. It was called Soundscapes. It was during Black Music Month. I actually got a mayoral citation during this too. I, I, I should be wearing it, but you know, I just want to tell you about it. It goes with the catalog, you know. Come signed also. This has all of my jazz pieces in it. So if you are a music enthusiast, this is a really nice catalog to have. It has a good cross section of all of my musical pieces, most of which were done for nonprofit organizations, art organizations, um, some of the jazz festivals is in this region, the Capital Jazz Festival, the Second Street Festival, um, the Macy's Music Festival. This right here has all of my musical pieces. And so we love these mini catalogs because I get a chance to show some works that you wouldn't normally see on my website. Um, and we're going to be doing a, really a whole series. Right now we have about four catalogs. Our goal is to get about 12 catalogs, all the same size. You can see this got a great cross section of pieces in it. It's about 28 pages, full color. Got a little, look at that. All kind of aspects of it. So in the back, it's got my bio. Again, it comes signed. This is the Soundscapes catalog. If you would like item number 15, the Soundscapes exhibition catalog, just put item number 15 and sold. And this catalog, will be coming your way. Yeah, y'all, we are on the books and catalogs today. You know, start off the fall in a nice, uh, productive way. Item number 16, y'all, is the last of our catalogs. <coughs> well, you know, I got one, I got one surprise after this, y'all. So I hope you, if you haven't been watching, just take your time and I want you to check this next piece out. But this catalog right here, is an important catalog because this is a solo show I did in Springfield, Massachusetts at a gallery called Art for the Soul. This is probably the largest collection of my work solo exhibition that had uh, outside of the state of Baltimore, outside of the state of Maryland, that had about me 30 of my originals up for probably two months. OK, this is the Stronger Than Pride exhibition. This has kind of a sprinkling of and you see that comes signed also of a lot of other pieces that are in my portfolio. So you'll see some pieces in here that may not appear in the other catalogs. Uh, it's got a little write up. These are some other pieces that I've done for other organizations, but not my music, you know, might be maybe one or two of my musical pieces in here. But it's got an overview of some of the other pieces that were highlighted in that exhibition. And so really nice pieces, nice coffee table 
kind of arrangement. I'm also announcing something else on the show today. Boy, we got so many announcements, but okay, let me stay focused now. This is the Stronger Than Pride catalog. Um, as you can see, it's got a good cross section of my work. The exhibition was very powerful. You might even be able to go on YouTube and Google Art, Art of the Soul Gallery, and you may even see a couple of news uh, presentations on the exhibition I did in Springfield. Which reminds me, I am doing a wonderful project in Springfield, Massachusetts in January. And I'll explain that to you maybe a little later on. But that is the Stronger Than Pride catalog, item number 16. All of those exhibition catalogs are $25. If you would like to have those, and they make a nice set, they make a nice set to a friend. If you consider yourself to be a Larry Poncho Brown enthusiast and you kind of think you know what my work looks like, I'm going to surprise you because you're going to see something in one of those catalogs you haven't seen before. Item number 16 and sold and the Stronger Than Pride catalog, exhibition catalog, will be coming your way. Are you ready, y'all, for item number 17? You know, every year, this is my 12th year actually um, doing a calendar. That's right. I leaked it. I leaked it. And uh, our 2021 calendar just got released two weeks ago. Item number 17, y'all. You ready for it, y'all? No, y'all ain't ready for it, but here you go. This is the, the Color My Soul 2021 calendar. That's right, y'all. This is a bad calendar. On the back, it has some of the images, some old, some new, some you've seen, some you have not seen on the inside. This is a wonderful collectible item, y'all. This is the 2021 calendar. Be the first one to get yours because you know I'm almost certain these were going to sell out. Every year we sell all of these pieces, but the pace on these, for some reason, has been a little faster this year. This is the Color My Soul 2021 calendar. It sells for $15. I will, let me, let me, let me tease you up a little bit, tease you up a little bit. This is, I'm just going to kind of go through it real quick so you can kind of see what's happening here you know it's got a nice little picture of me in there it's got some of my original works it's got some old favorites it's got some oh man some classics it's got some new stuff you haven't seen that don't even look like poncho do it maybe it had somebody else do it i'm not sure here you go yeah y'all think y'all y'all know my work don't you you know i'm one of those artists that i have so many different styles if you don't know my name you'll probably get lost this has been a very popular piece for me. I didn't expect that because this piece was actually originally done as one of my paint party pieces. Look at that. That's from one of my new works. So many people haven't seen my new textural works. I just sold that original on Poncho Thon. I can't tell you what number it was, but we sold that one on the show. We also sold this one on Poncho Thon too. Good original pieces. If you are trying to look for originals, this is the space to come because you know at the end of the show, we always. This piece also was show, sold on Poncho Thon. That's right, y'all. These are all my new textural pieces. That piece right there. Look at that piece, y'all. Does that look like Poncho? I don't know. Hmm. Who that look like? Who that? Okay. So there you go, y'all. I'm showing you the calendar. A classic. A classic at the end of December. You know, December is my birthday. All right, y'all. So I just gave y'all the preview to the color my soul calendar. Item number 17. If you want that and you want to be the first one to get the color my soul calendar before they sell out this year. Item number 17 and sold and that calendar will be coming <coughs> your way. Now, what I didn't mention, which I should have mentioned, is that you if you're new to the show. Everything you buy here, you get something free. It's the hallmark of Poncho Thon. When you buy one item, you get an item free. If you buy two items, you get two items free. You buy five items, you get five items free. Do I need to go on? This is a show that kind of, uh, our whole thing is trying to share and getting you to share. And not only just sharing our art, but getting you to share art with people in your family and your friends. And especially in these kind of times, you get to kind of love up on some of the people around you because everybody's isolated right now and this is a real important time for us to pull together so that's a big part of poncho thon not only do you get prices that you can't find anywhere on the internet i'm including both of my websites you also get a gift free we have flat rate shipping y'all flat rate shipping flat rate shipping of ten dollars 
$10 per package. If your stuff comes in two packages, it's $20. But I will assure you, most of you, your works will fit in one package. But if by chance we have to break it up, like if you buy three calendars and you get a print, of course, that's going to have to go in two different packages because we pride ourselves on packing things properly so they get to you safely. So a $10 flat rate shipping fee is applied to your package. Um, make sure you give us the item number and the word sold and we will send you a PayPal invoice uh, towards the end of the show. You'll get it in the next 48 hours. And then, um, hey, your items will be coming your way. All right, y'all, what other uh, announcements I wanna make? Okay, so you know, I am um, working on a special project. I took off for a couple of weeks because I'm working on a film, a documentary called The Golden Age of African American Art. The Golden Age of African American Art started between 1985 and 2005, and it really covers this big art explosion, this big art revolution that took place in the 80s. And I want you to uh, check it out. Go to YouTube and punch up. Uh, we're also broadcasting on YouTube now, in case you don't know. You can always go to YouTube and see us if you want to catch us there. But look up The Golden Age of African American Art, and you will see the pre-trailer to the documentary that we're working on. Some of the top artists in the country are going to be in this thing. And I, we finally have entered editing stage on that documentary. If you want to help us out, go to goldenageofafricanamericanart.com and you will see all the things, the background about the film and the documentary itself. You'll see where you can actually support us if you want to support this endeavor. But I'm telling y'all, this is going to be my legacy project. This is going to be what I leave behind to actually talk about a movement that I was fortunate enough to participate in. So I hope you guys, if you don't know about it, you'll check it out and I'll be talking about it more on future shows. Item number, woo! 18. Item number 18, we kind of we had to bring this one back. Now I can't do catalogs. And then don't bring this catalog. This this let me explain to you about this. This is called the Visions of Our 44th President Project. This project is probably 10 years old now, y'all. What happened was, what had happened was 44 artists around the country were invited, prominent African American artists were invited to paint a rendition of a bust of Obama. Me and Charles Bibbs were the last of the 44. In other words, I, um, bus number 44 was created by me and Charles Bibbs. And we are the only two artists that worked a collaboration on this piece. So our piece is in this book, page number 26, if you get a chance to look. But this book has every one of those masks, I mean, those, those busts. Uh, and this is an excellent little coffee table book. It has a nice picture of him. Of course, it's got all the artists in their rendition, the title of the piece. Uh, that's, that's our piece. That's me and Charles's piece right there. And as you can see, um, I'm, I'm working backwards on the camera. That one is done by, that's Charles's side, and this is my side. So if you want to get this book, this is the book. This is a wonderful collectible. It's only $25 if you, because I know y'all miss them. With all this crazy stuff going on right now, I know you're missing. I don't, I don't, I, I'm, hey, I don't know whether you like them, don't like I don't, but if you want a piece of history. And let me tell you something else that happened. This exhibition was held at the Charles Wright Museum in, in Detroit, Michigan. Beautiful exhibition. It ran for about maybe six to eight months. It has traveled since to Miami, where it was shown for an additional I think three to four months. It was held, part, a, a couple of the busts were featured at the Essence Music Festival a couple of years. They were just about to relaunch this show at the Charles Wright Museum when COVID hit. So if you want to support this book, item number 18, it only sells for $25. Item number 18 and sold. And the book, Visions of Our 44th President, will be coming your way. Yeah, y'all, so we're going to go over to the slides now so y'all can see what's happening. We're going to uh, get you going. This is item number 19. Item number 19 is an open edition print. We're going to start with the open editions first. Celebrate freedom, y'all. This is item number 19. This piece normally sells for $40. You can get the piece Celebrate Freedom for just $20. All of the pieces in this section are open edition uh, posters and they will come signatured. If you want item number 19, put item number 19 and sold. And this piece, Celebrate Freedom, which was done for the Underground Museum 
in, uh, uh, what was that? Cincinnati, Ohio, y'all. That's right. I get around. Item number 19 is $20. If you want to add that piece to your collection, just put number 19 and sold. And this piece, Celebrate Freedom, will be coming your way. Item number 20 is a piece that was done for a festival in, oh, of all places, Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, the Emoja Festival. This piece is entitled To the Beat of the Drum, y'all. To the Beat of the Drum. This piece right here normally sells for $40, but you can get this piece and set off that special space in your house for just $20, y'all. That's the number right here. We're in the $20 section, y'all. You see we go, what? We getting up there, we getting up there. But these are nice entry-level pieces for those of you that just want to decorate your space. You know, all of us been home now, y'all. We've been home for months. I'm watching people, they straighten up their houses, man. They're decorating, they're getting art for the walls. They was outside gardening, they were growing vegetables. Y'all just showing off. Item number 20, y'all. It's a piece called To the Beat of the Drum if you want to add that to your collection and show some of your ethnicity. Just put item number 20 in sold and this piece will be coming your way. Item number 21, y'all, all you readers out there. That's right. This piece is done for all you readers out there because I know a whole lot of reading is going on. This piece is called, ooh, this piece is called Enlightenment. Enlightenment. This is a small little original piece that I sold years ago. We decided to decide to go and try to do some pieces that really kind of speak to some of the movements. You know, Oprah Winfrey had book clubs all over the country. So this piece was actually created around the time when all these book clubs were happening. I had number 21. It's a piece we call Enlightenment. If you would like to add that to your collection and it will also come signed, just put item number 21 and so an Enlightenment will be yours. Item number 22 is along that same line, but this piece is called Our Story. It was done for the Our Story Expo, which was a another book fair that was happening in Cincinnati, Ohio. If you look at the background, you'll see all of the... Uh, whew, the ancestors, y'all, because you know what? We wouldn't be here right now if the ancestors weren't helping us out. This piece right here is the ancestors overseeing a family teaching their son their history. The story is called Our Story. That's right, item number 22. If you would like Our Story, just put item number 22 and so it sells for just $20, y'all. Get it for your friends. Your friends will love you for it. All right, y'all, item number 22 and so Item number 23, y'all, is a piece we call Sankofa. Sankofa is a word that means um, learning from our past to determine our future, or looking back on our past to determine our future. This piece shows the central theme of a family. It was actually done for the Cincinnati Fine Art Festival years ago. Uh, if you look at all of the patterns on their outfits, those are all different renditions of the symbol, which is an adinkra symbol called Sankofa. It's actually a bird a leaning back. You'll see three different versions. It also is shown as a heart in case you didn't know it. This is Sankofa, item number 23. If you want to add number 23 to your collection, put item number 23 and sold in this piece. Sankofa will be coming your way. All right, y'all, this next piece coming up is called Now and Forever. It was actually created for a early uh, memory loss, dementia, and Alzheimer's organization here in Baltimore, Maryland. Um, this is a popular piece because we have very few pieces that actually depict our elders. So this was a different project for me. I hope you'll enjoy it too, but it's so pertinent because so many of us are dealing with aspects of dementia and early uh, memory loss. Um, is I have three friends now that are going through that. So I try to do pieces that depict the struggles that we have as well as the things that lift us up. So this piece is called Now and Forever. It sells normally for $40 today. You get it on Poncho Thon number 26 for just $20, y'all. We're in a $20 section. Everybody got $20. Get one for your friend. You know, you got somebody home right now and they're lonely and they're isolated. They're in their homes by themselves. They're hunkered down just like you, but you're fortunate because, see, you're home and you're feeling crazy with people around you. Well, what about the people that's home that don't have nobody around them? So if you grab this piece, make sure you share this with somebody at home who you know will be uplifted by letting them know you're thinking about them. Item number 24 is now and forever. Put number 24 and sold, and that piece will be coming your way for your what? 
collection because if you got three pieces, y'all, you got a collection. Item number 25, y'all, coming up. You know, we try to support all our uh, sororities. And so I've done a couple of shows where we've done tributes to them. But because there's so much going on in the world right now and divisiveness, I want to show you things of where there's unity. This piece is called the pass. It's called Passing the Torch. Actually, it was done for the 100th anniversary of the Delta Sigma Thetas. This open edition normally sells for $40. The sizes of these things are in the 22 by 28 range. This piece now and forever is available today for just $20, y'all. Now it's time to move, y'all. It's time to unify. All you Delta Sigma Theta folks out there, y'all know y'all need to get together. You can buy two or three DDs for your friends and have your whole Christmas thing covered. This is passing the torch item number 25. Just put item number 25 and sold, and this piece will be coming your way and hopefully coming to your Sora's way. Item number 26. It's a piece we call Jazz on Ogons Avenue. This is a, uh, a tribute to my folks in Philly. That's right. I'm about to go to Philly in a couple of weeks to film a gentleman that I have a lot of respect for by the name of Mercer Red Cross. Mercer Red Cross was responsible for one of the largest art shows in the United States at one time. It was known as the October Gallery Show, the Philadelphia Fine Art Show. I am going to interview him for the Golden Age of African American Art movie documentary that we're working on. And so this piece is a tribute to Philly. This is Jazz on Ogons Avenue, a festival I used to participate in. I did the poster for that festival three times. This is one of the three images. Jazz on Ogons Avenue is item number 26. Normally sells for $40, y'all. But if you want it, today we are in the $20 section, y'all. You can get this piece for $20. No money for $40. That's right. Item number 26 and sold. And Jazz on Ogons Avenue will be coming your way. Oh, but wait. Now, I told you I did three. This is another one I did. One. This was called Live on Ogons. This is item number 27. It was done for the West Oak Lane Jazz and Art Festival. That's right, y'all. That's a big mouthful. Don't make me say it again. <laughs> I might not remember it. <laughs> Stop laughing over there, Leonard. You know my technician, Leonard. Leonard is my, he's my comic relief. I, I know when I'm, when I'm landing and when I'm not because Leonard is quiet over there most of the time. Every now and then I get a little giggle out of him. So at number 27, this is live on Ogons Avenue. Normally sells for $40, y'all. Today you can get it for just $20. All of the pieces in this section will come autographed. Item number 27 and sold. And live on Ogons will be coming your way. Item number 28, y'all. It's the last of our $20 pieces. This piece is called The Culture Keepers. It was actually done for an African-American festival in Raleigh, North Carolina. Did it a few years ago. This piece is called The Culture Keepers. It has a griot, a drummer, and a dancer. What do I need to say? It's the essence of our culture right there, y'all. It's got a lot of movement in it, too. If you need some movement in your house, because sometimes you put stagnant art in your house and your art, your house looks stagnant. Now you need to put something with movement in it. You can add some life and movement to it. Woo! I'll say that again at a later date. This is item number 28. <laughs> I didn't mean for that to rhyme. I know it sounded like it though, didn't it? <laughs> item number 28. This is the Culture Keeper sells for $40. Normally today you can get it for just $20. Just put number 28 and sold in the Culture Keepers can be part of your collection. Shout outs to all my people out there. Thank you for taking the time to tune in with us. Hey, Rhonda Parker. Hey, Lisa Williams. Hey, Katrina Great Thomas. Hey, Yvette Fuller. What's happening? Denise Hall Brown. What's happening? Barbara Cooper. What's happening? Ed Edwina Ware. What's happening? Carolyn Morrison. What's happening? Oh, Sherry Muhammad. What's happening? Deborah Loudon. What's happening? Ken, Ken Dacey. What's up, Ken Dacey? Ken Dacey is a cool person. She's here in b -more. I got some cool people in b -more. What's happening, Aaron Rice, my brother? He's down the hallway watching my show. Tell me that ain't some love right there, right? What's happening, Barbara Gilbert? What's happening? Oh, we got some new faces. Karen Walker. What's going on, Miss Rhonda Parker? Hey, y'all, we got a good following of folks from all over the country. We hoping you'll tell your friends. Hey, look, this is a perfect time in the show for me to ask a special favor for you. Will you please take the time to send me your email address and your shipping address? Please, I'll say it again one more time, please. This is a perfect time for you to DM us, direct message us at either one of our pages on Art of Poncho on, or on Larry Poncho Brown in either one of those mailboxes. Leave me your email address 
and your shipping address. Because what's going to happen is at the end of this show, I'm going to send you a PayPal invoice and it's going to have all your items on it. But if I don't get your email address and your shipping address, it's going to be hard for me to connect to you. Some of these items we don't have a lot of, so we're going to go by a timestamp to tell who's getting what. But overall, most of the things we've shown so far, we have an adequate inventory on. As we get towards the end of the show, we're going to be having some items that are one of a kind or I'm going to have to be by timestamp because we only have four or five of them, okay? I'll let you know what those are. But you can help me out dramatically. If you, if this is your first time with us, please take time to do that right now, right? If you've already purchased from us before, you good. We got you in the system, all right? We got a lot of loyal followers. Hey, thank you, uh, Gayla. I appreciate those words. What's up, Terry? All right, y'all, y'all ready to get back into it? Item number 29, y'all. We are moving into a different section of the show now. We are now into the limited editions. This is the adult section, y'all. For those of you that, yeah, I know, I ain't got to say nothing. You can look on the screen and see what's happening. We are celebrating black love for a little bit because you know what other rates are going up high in this country right now? There's a lot of live love going on. You never hear about the love, but the domestic violence uh, numbers in this country are going through the roof. So we're going to lean on the side of love. OK, here we go. This piece is not item number 29. One place is normally sells for seventy five dollars. It's a limited edition of eight fifty. It's about maybe uh, I would say 17 by 27 inches or something like that. Twenty one by twenty seven in that general family range. It's a limited edition of eight fifty. It normally sells for seventy five dollars, y'all. On Poncho Thon number twenty six, you can get this series because it's actually a piece that comes with this. Item number twenty nine, you can get for thirty five dollars, y'all. We're in the limited edition section. Item number twenty nine, just put item number twenty nine and sold, and warm places will be coming your way. But wait. Here's another part to the series. It's called Stolen Moments, y'all. Stolen Moments, item number 30. If you would like to add item number 30 and item number 29, they make a really nice set, nice bedroom pieces. Just put item number 30 for Stolen Moments. It sells normally for $75. It's an 850 edition. Today on Poncho Thon 26, you can get this piece for just $35. $35. Did I say that right? $35. That's right, y'all. It'll be nice in your collection. You know, you need something for the bedroom, bathroom. You just, who said you just got to hang in your living room and dining room, right? I've been to some houses that will blow your socks off, y'all. But anyway, item number 30. Just put 30 and sold, and that piece will be added to your collection. Item number 31 is a piece we did. This is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, y'all. Breast Cancer Awareness Month. You know, they got months for everything, right? But this one is uh, um, an important one to me. My mother passed from breast cancer. She actually is the statistic you very seldom hear. She didn't actually die from her disease. She died from an operation that she took to correct the disease. So if you look at this piece, you see five figures. But if you notice, if you look on the edges, you see two ghosted figures. Those two ghosted figures are the ladies that did not survive. The five women that you see embracing each other have survived. This piece is called Ribbons of Life. It's a celebration of survivorship. This piece was done in honor of my mom and her struggle and so many of my friends' struggles. But it also was created for a African-American breast survivorship organization in New Haven, Connecticut called Sister's Journey. All right. They did two pieces in honor of their events. This was one of their celebrations. This piece is called Ribbons of Life. It normally sells for $75. It's an 850 edition. Today, you can get Ribbons of Life for $35, y'all. $35 by two. Getting the two important people who you know are in the struggle and who are in the perseverance and are surviving. It is a celebration of life doing Breast Cancer Awareness Month. This couldn't be a better month to give this piece as a gift. All right, y'all. Item number 31 is sold, and that piece will be coming your way. Item number 32. That's right, y'all. We got to get back to the sororities because I know they think I forgot about them. This is called The Pledge. This is for Delta Sigma Theta. This is one of the pieces we did for them quite a few years ago. This piece normally sells for $75, y'all. But today on Poncho Thon number 26, you can get the pledge for $35. That means you can get one for you. You can get one for your Sora. You can get one for your Sora's daughter. You can get one for your Sora's... Well, you get what I'm saying. 
spread it out spread the love because you know everything you buy here you get something free right everything you buy on poncho thon 26 you get something free so i want y'all to give as much as you're receiving i have been blessed throughout my life to be an artist and to have a wonderful following of people right now my works are currently in about 500,000 homes around the country this is my 35th year as a professional artist <clears throat> and my 40th year as an artist period so that's right y'all this is all about love spread it all spread the love around this is item number 32 this piece is called the pledge it normally sells for 75 dollars you can get it for 35 dollars y'all just put item number 32 and sold and it'll be coming your way y'all all right you know we can't do this if i have representing everybody this is for aka this is done for organization up in new jersey popular piece called pearls of wisdom this is item number 33 Item number 33 sells for $90, y'all, $90. But today on Poncho Thon, you can get Pearls of Wisdom for $35. I don't think we've ever sold Pearls of Wisdom for $35 on this show before. But we got a couple pieces on this list that we're getting ready to retire. So this is a good time to snag them up. Holiday seasons are coming. All right. Item number 33, this is Pearls of Wisdom. You can get this piece for $35. Comes with a certificate of authenticity. As a matter of fact, all the pieces in this limited edition section come with a certificate of authenticity. If you don't get one and you got a couple pieces from us in the past, if I miss your certificate, send me a line. We'll, we'll take care of that for you, all right? That's item number 33. Put number 33 in the soul, and this wonderful piece will be coming your way and added to your collection. Item number 34, that's right, we got them all covered. Now, for all you who are sitting around pouting, we got Zeta Rations in the house. This is in honor of Zeta, Phi Beta. This piece right here, item number 34, normally sells for $125, y'all, $125. So you get this piece for $50. Doing Poncho Thon number 26, y'all, because we're spreading the love. And remember, everything you purchase here, you get something free. But Zeta Rations is a generational piece. It's got a lot of beauty and love in it. Ooh, just take time to look at that for me. If that don't calm you, that blue or that white, that the introspective look that's in their faces, the bird flying, the white roses just... Okay, I'm back, I'm, I'm back. Item number 34, y'all. Item number 34 is called Zeta Rations. It sells for 125 today on Poncho Thon number 26. You can get this piece for $50, y'all. Just $50. Put number 34 and sold, and this will be added to your collection. That's right, y'all. Item number 35, y'all. For all you links out there, because I know you links out there saying, okay, now he's got the sororities out there, but you know, we kind of like a sorority. You know, I don't never knew whether y'all were a sorority or not. Uh, for those of you that are out there, educate me. Is is Lynx called a sorority or is Lynx just an organization? I mean, I mean explain it to me what it is. I was commissioned to do this by the Lynx, and to me, it seemed like it was another one of those types of organizations. But this is item number 35, Links of Courage. It normally sells for $90, y'all. It's an 850 edition. You get it today for just $40, y'all. Links of Courage, item number 35. Just put 35 in sold. And Links of Courage will be coming your way. All those pieces are under 22 by 28 range, but this one I'm getting ready to show you is a almost a 40 inch piece. I'm getting to the big stuff now, y'all. Item number 36. This is called Cruise the Night Away. And all y'all, <laughs> oh, I don't know about y'all, but I've probably been on maybe 12 cruises. I like, I, I can't say I love cruising. I like cruising. I like cruising because I can go to three or four different locations on one trip. And uh, yeah, I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a medium to large size dude. So yeah, the food is good. <laughs> I also am an avid swimmer. And you know, I'm bougie when it comes to water. It's like, I can't swim in this area because the water, if I can't see that shark just get ready to eat me, I can't get in that water. But in the Caribbean, whoo-hoo, I can swim all day long, y'all. But I'm, I'm missing me some cruises. Now, I know I can get a cruise real cheap about right now, <laughs> but I ain't ready. But anyway, this piece was done. For a black organization that, that does cruises. Isn't that something? They specialize in cruises. Our gang travel up in New Jersey. It's commissioned me to do this for one of their cruises. It's called Cruise the Night Away. It normally sells for $125. 
It's an addition of 850. It is a huge piece. You want a big piece that looks tropical? This is it. The black love subject. You notice how I'm playing with the black love subject today? Yeah, I know. I try to do these little themes. I hope y'all catch on to them. This one is called Cruise the Night Away. This is item number 36. It sells today on Poncho Thon 26 for just $75, y'all. We are in the $75 portion of the show. This is a huge piece. Cruise the Night Away. $75, just put number 36 in, sold, and this piece will be across your wall. This is one of those pieces that when you frame it, it's going to shut people down when they come in your house. Item number 36, just put 36 in, sold, and cruise the night away. It will be added to your what? Can I hear you say it, y'all? Can I hear you say it? Collection. That's right. Item number 37, y'all, this is an old classic. Now, I don't even know why I put this on the show today because I got some old classics that's about to be retired from the show. You know, when I say retire from the show, Poncho Thon was put together as a way for me to share my work with my followers and to build a new level of followers and to share the immense amount of inventory that I have amassed in the last 35 years of me being in this business. So I get a chance to give you something that I can't give regularly and COVID was really the best format for me to do that because we've introduced so many new people to art but this is an old classic right here it's called interdependence it's a 850 edition this piece right here on the secondary market sells for 300 dollars today on poncho thon number 26 you can get this piece for only 75 dollars now when you watch poncho thon don't get comfortable don't say I saw it on, on Poncho Thon number two for that price because we are going to adjust the price the way we feel that particular day and that particular show. Uh, but as we start running out of inventory, we're going to retire pieces and you may see pieces released at different prices on Poncho Thon. So it's real important that you kind of gauge your jump in. But on Poncho Thon, the incentive is for you to get it while you have it available to you. OK, interdependence is one of those pieces. It's a classic. It sells for $300 on the open market. Today on Poncho Thon, you can get interdependence for $37. And interdependence is a strong word. It didn't say independence. It said interdependence. It's a male and female piece. It's part of my Harmony series. You see the, uh, every range of who we are in this piece. This piece is also made to hang in a diamond. So you can put whatever face you feel most comfortable with at the top of the piece. I had number 37 and sold. Interdependence can be yours for $75. Just put $75 and sold. I mean, put $37 and sold, and it'll be coming your way. Item number 38, back to the big pieces. This piece right here is almost 40 inches wide, too. You're looking for a big sofa piece. You're looking for something that's kind of spiritual. This is part of my stained glass series. This piece is entitled Fountain Family. This piece normally sells for $125. On Poncho Thon number 26, you can get this piece for $75, y'all. Oh, that's right. This is called Fountain Family. All of these pieces in this section come with a certificate of authenticity. You know when you buy one thing here, you get a what? You get something free. This is Fountain Family. If you want this piece, just put number 38 and soul, and you can get Interdependence, which is a, I mean, a uh, Fountain Family, which is a really nice size piece. You know, most of my pieces fall within the 22 by 28 range or the 24 by 36 range, right? But this piece right here is almost 40 inches. So, this is not for everybody. But if you need a nice size piece, whoo, this is the one. Item number 38, Fountain Family. Just put 38 in sold. And that piece will be yours for $75. Now, y'all, we are moving to another section. This section is all collectibles, y'all. This is where the numbers go up to $100. But let me tell you what some of the prices of these pieces. This piece right here is a favorite of ours. It's called Sheer Essence. The notion of Sheer Essence is about a keepsake, an heirloom, something that's passed down. It's like a legacy piece, okay? That's what these pieces are all about. Sheer Essence 1 and 2 were very, very popular pieces. They also have, and it's hard to tell from this particular photograph, they have gold leaf in them in different places. So these are really high collectible pieces. They normally sell for around $300 each. These are small intimate pieces though. They're the 17 by 22 inches, but the gold leaf in them is off the charts, y'all. So here we go. Sheer Essence number one is item number 39. Notice it says number one because you know there's what? A number two. Sheer Essence number one normally sells for $300. 
on Poncho Thon number 26, you can get Sheer Essence. And this is going to be one that's going to be retired soon, y'all. You can get Sheer Essence for just the low price of $100. It comes from a certificate of authenticity. It is a 1,000 edition. This is a very, very popular piece. This is a piece that's very, very hard to find in galleries, too. Okay? Sheer Essence number one can be yours for just $100. And when you get it, if you like it on the screen, you're going to love it in your house because the gold leaf is popping on this particular piece. Item number 39 and sold. And Sheer Essence number one will be yours for $100. But wait. Sheer Essence number two is the counterpart to Sheer Essence number one. One's holding a diamond, one, one's holding a square, one's holding a circle. Okay? These pieces both have gold leaf. It's four color printing with gold leaf added. It's beautiful process. I have very few pieces that are done that way. I might have four pieces in my whole portfolio and I'm talking about hundreds and hundreds of pieces that have this combination. I'm really proud of this combination. Uh, Shearance number two sells for $300. It sells today on Pontothon number 26 for just $100. If you would like that set, that's a monster set. Matter of fact, you need to get one for your girlfriend too. Stop playing. I know y'all don't like seeing the same thing in each other's houses, but these pieces are so intimate and so wonderful looking. You got to get one of these and share with your friends. Or if you got a sister and y'all love each other, you take one, you give her number two. There you go. Item number 40 is Sheer Essence number two. It sells for $100 on Poncho Thon number 26. If you want this piece, just put item number 40 and sold. And that piece will be coming your way. All right, y'all, we're over the hunt now. We're getting down to the last nine pieces. This piece right here is an old favorite. We bring it back from time to time. I want to tell you up front, item number 41, we only have five of these pieces available. This is one of the few pieces that's getting ready to be retired from Poncho Thon. That means you'll be able to buy it from a website at the regular cost, but you will not be able to see this piece much longer on Poncho Thon. This piece is called The Guardian. The Guardian sells normally for $400, y'all. $400. On Poncho Thon number 26, you can get The Guardian. There's only five available. We will go by timestamp. In other words, the first five people to chime in, this piece belongs to you. This piece is selling on Poncho Thon number 26 for the price of $100. It retails for $400. This is a very special buy. Only five available. If you want this piece, Put number 41 and sold. And this piece, The Guardian, will be yours for $100. The counterpart to this piece sells for $800. It's called Heaven Sense. It was part of a series that I did, Angel series that I did. But if you want this piece, this is the time to move. There's only five available. Item number 41 and sold. And The Guardian will be coming your way. Another favorite, y'all, is a piece called The Blackness. The Blackness has a counterpart that was actually done with a white background some of my collectors my loyal collectors have the version of the white background that piece has been sold out for several several years and it's very very hard to find this piece is only a 600 edition we only have five of these available for the show just five pieces that we have to go by timestamp on this if you want the guardian same thing this piece retails for four hundred dollars Today on Ponchathon number 26, you will get this piece for just $100, y'all. $100. If you want this piece to blackness, just put number 42 and sold. And this piece will be added to your collection. And hey, I, I won't treat you wrong, y'all. This is a good opportunity to have a nice collectible that many people can't find in galleries right now. There you go, y'all. Item number 42. 42 and sold and the blackness will be yours for $100, normally $400. All right, y'all, we are moving out of the limited edition section into the offset limited edition section into the G. Clay section. G. Clay is a plotter-based piece done on archival paper. These are done on, on thicker watercolor paper. The colors and the pigments are permanent. Um, G clays tend to cost a little more and the additions tend to be a little higher. Offset lithograph prints is a baseline print reproduction method. If you see anything in color, whether it be an album cover or a poster or a magazine, um, those are, that is a, a baseline color printing reproduction method in the United States. Okay. So G clays are another level up y'all. That's why they cost a little more, but we get ready to get into that. We got a couple pieces here that I know you're going to love this next piece 
is entitled, this is one of my new pieces, created in 2020. This piece is entitled Of Queens. That's right, y'all, Of Queens. Who? Of Queens. What do I, do I need to say anything else? See, when I went to high school, my art teacher said to me when I first walked in his class, he said, Poncho, you are a descendant of kings. And, you know, in the 70s, I thought he was crazy. I really did. I didn't know what that meant. I thought he was being, I didn't know what he was trying to say to me. But this concept of descending from royalty and all the things we persevered in this country is why I did this piece. Of Queens. Normally sells for $300. It's a G. Clay's of 62 in the edition. Today on Poncho Thon. You can get Of Queens for just $150. This is a very, very nice collectible piece. If you like this piece, put item number 43 in soul, and this piece will be coming your way. But wait. The male counterpart is called Of Kings. Item number 44. If you would like to add item number 44, and y'all just want to have that set because it's an exciting looking set, y'all. This is item number 44, normally sells for $300. It's a 62 edition. You will get this piece for $150 only for Poncho Thon number 26, y'all. I don't know when you're going to see it at that price again. You go to my website right now, you'll see it for $300. I'm going to leave it right there. Item number 44. Just put item number 44 and sold. And this piece of Kings, a new, a new edition will be coming your way. Now, along the way, I did a whole series of pieces that's on this kind of stylization because I was trying to celebrate blackness. I guess you look at me and you go, well, I can see why you're celebrating blackness. But, you know, we're in a time right now. If we celebrate blackness, something might be wrong with you. You know. I'm going to take a breather on that one. The next one, item number 45. Is a piece I call Black One. Black One. I'm celebrating blackness i didn't use no brown i wanted to use tones of gray and, and black i wanted him to be and, and i just have this test textural thing happening so you could see um the, the different elements of spirituality that comes with our people right it's a celebration of blackness this is called black one the g clay sells for 300 dollars. the edition size is 62 right same thing y'all this piece can be yours for $150 on Poncho Thon number 26, y'all. But wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a minute. It comes in another set. Here you go. Item number 46. Black 2. Black 2. That's right, y'all. B-L-A-Q-U-E. Black 1 and Black 2. You can get this piece a perfect set. I don't know which set I like the best. But, you know, both of them speak to the same thing. If you would like a black two, this is item number 46. It normally sells for $300 on Poncho Thon 26. You can have that piece for just $150, y'all. Woo, imagine both of those sitting next. Wait a minute now. Whoa, 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 wait a minute. Wait a minute. I'm, I'm going crazy now. What about if you had all four of those on your wall? Ow! Folk might not be able to handle that much black, but I'm going to wish you luck if you do that. But here you go, y'all. Item number 46. If you want black too, just put item number 46 in sold, and that piece will be in your collection for just $150, y'all. Okay, I'm going to take you back for a minute. You know, every now and then I shake you to a piece that was getting ready to retire, and this next piece is getting ready to retire. But we're getting near the end of the show. We got four more items. So this is one of those pieces that's a special buy. I'm going to set it up, though, first. So we won't have no problems. Item number 47. There's only three of these available. All right. This is a historic piece that I'm getting ready to show you. There's only three available. These pieces on the secondary market sells for $1,200. Today on Poncho Thon. Well, I'm going to hold that back till I show you the piece. Item. Number 47 is our old time favorite. This piece is a historic piece because it is a three artist collaboration. This piece is including LaShawn Beale, Leroy Campbell, and myself. This is the first three artist collaboration that was ever published in the African American art realm. This piece is very, very, very hard to find. The secondary market on this print is 12 dollars y'all 
Poncho Thorn. Leonard, I think Leonard plays with my numbers at night because this number don't make no sense, man. Are you messing with my numbers, Leonard? I'm, I'm, I'm not even gonna mess with them right now. I had a number 47 today. It's selling for $250. There is only three of these available, so I'm not even gonna talk anymore. The first three to snag this piece up before we retire this, we'll get it for $250. This is Peacekeepers, The Peacekeepers by LaShawn Beal, Leroy Campbell, and Larry Poncho Brown. Only three available. Normally twelve hundred dollars. It's a fifteen hundred edition. It's yours for two fifty for a limited time. And three people, three people. Oh, that's all it's gonna be. Three people, and it's gonna be gone. All right, y'all. Next piece, cause this one's gonna be gone quick. Only three available. Item number forty-eight is a piece we call in his hands. It's a G clay. It's a large piece. This piece is possibly. 40 inches wide. It is um, a very powerful piece. It's part of my Perseverance series. As you can see, this brother is also on the catalog that I showed earlier today. Um, the catalog, the uh, collages catalog. In his hands, if you look over his hands, you'll see there's like some patterns going on there, but you don't really see what's happening. But camouflage above his hands is a symbol called the Jinyame. The Jinyame is an African symbol that means fear no one except God. That peace is a very very powerful piece it has all kinds of words in it that really will um, be a nice conversation piece in your home but it also shows a lot of power this piece is called in his hands for today's show we only have three of these available if you would like in his hands that piece normally sells for five hundred dollars today you can get this piece for three hundred dollars and it's only three available so if you want it by timestamp in his hands number 48 if you'd like in his hands number 48 just put 48 and sold and this piece will be yours for just a low price of 300 dollars. only three available first come first serve all right y'all we get to the last two items of the show this is where i turn the show over to my man um he's just gonna he's gonna show you some stuff man this is item number 49 Item number 49 is a rare piece. It's, it's an original. The last two items on the show today are original pieces. If you are a beginning collector and you have not started collecting originals, this is a perfect entry level original. What you are looking at is an ink and watercolor study of a part of a dance series that I did. This piece is called Greatest of Ease number six. It is a celebration of dance, but it also is a a really wonderful stylized piece um you know our, people very seldom get a chance to see my original works they very seldom get a chance to see my studies this is the best of both worlds this piece is called greatest of ease it comes frame the last two items are going to require an additional 40 dollars of shipping because these pieces will come framed as they are all right this piece measures probably 11 by 14, but it's a smaller piece, it's five by seven with double mat. This is item number 49. It normally sells for $900 as an original. Today, you can get Greatest of Ease already framed for $350. There's only one available. The first one on timestamp will receive Greatest of Ease number six. Take a looky look, y'all. This piece is done in watercolor and pen and in ink. You will really get an opportunity to see my studies. As we progress through the year, I'm going to start showing you more of my small originals and drawings. This is a great entry level piece. Item number 49 and sold. And that piece, the first person to chime in will own greatest of ease number six. And our last piece for the day, take them over to it, Leonard Evans, is a piece called Part of the Tribe. It's a framed original piece. Look at that green frame. Look at the green inside the piece. Woo, you see a lot of Africa in that. This piece is called Part of the Tribe. If you get up close to it, you will see. It is a drawing over top of watercolor. It is a mixed media piece. It has a multitude of faces and, 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 and it's a... A very spiritual piece right here if you look at this you might see three or four different faces in this piece the um the main medium is graphite 
and it's over watercolor. And what's significant about the background is my father painted that background. It's done on paper. I did pencil work on top of it. It's the best of both worlds because it has me and my dad's work together. It's also, I look at it like an ancestry piece. This piece is called Part of the Tribe. The original would sell for $1,100 today. You can have Part of the Tribe for $450 framed, $450. If you're looking for an entry level original, this piece, part of the tribe, is it. It is one of those kind of pieces. Item number 50, it's the last one of the day. Normally sells for $1,100, today for 50. Remember, the last two items are an additional $40. This is where I start to chime off, y'all. The first ones to chime on those pieces, they belong to you. Thank you so much for joining me today. I think we got ourselves done here in a reasonable amount of time. I want you to get you into the, the festivities that's happening tonight. Sorry we were a little late, a little bit of the live demons. Remember, if this is your first time joining the show, make sure you send us your email address and your shipping address. That will greatly help us. We will be sending you a PayPal invoice in the next 48 hours. If you have anything else you want or something you want me to feature on the show, drop me a line. DM me some suggestions on some things you would like to see or pieces that you would like to see. And we will see you in two weeks. I'm about to sign off, y'all. Hold on, y'all. Recognize where you are. Recognize the time. And I want to say something really important, y'all. I lost a really good friend Prayers up for my friend Ronald Cheney. He was a partner of mine for 30 years. Uh, he had a gallery called Ethnic Art Gallery in Kansas City, Missouri. We've been uh, partners in crime for over 30 years. We just recently did an exhibition with me and Charles Bibbs work at his gallery, and he passed away last week. I'm going to be going out to his event this weekend. So wish me safe travels, but send prayers up to my friend Ronald Cheney. Uh, he was a godsend and a wonderful friend. So hey, y'all. Tomorrow's not promised. Let's enjoy what we have. Until next time, I love you. Peace out.